Hi, I'm Lou with another episode of My Car Story, and today is more of a special treat. We're going to go for a ride. I'm out in Scottsdale at the Barrett Jackson Showroom, and I'm with Chris. Chris, good to see you. Nice to see you. And Chris, what's your last name? Griggs. Griggs, and he's the salesperson here. So if you ever wanted to get a car like this one, where would they go? They'd go to barrett-jackson.com, click on the showroom page, and it'll take you right to all our cars. Let's take a look. I actually got the hood open on this one so that you can start with the engine, which is so quiet, you don't even know it's running. We're going to take you on a ride in the 52 Ford Crestliner. Hopefully that all came out. All right, let's, uh, let's shut the hood, just so I can show them what this looks like. Beautiful. And one of the reasons why I'm taking Chris along with the ride, actually, he's driving me, is because uh, he's so tall that uh, I want to make sure he's comfortable in this car. Let's take a look at this car from the side. Yeah, that all looks great. We did do a review on this car, so if you want to see this car in greater detail, go to the review. Chris, come on, let's go for a ride. Sunliner. Chris Line V8. And here we go. Oh, I love that sound. Nice heavy doors for you. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to feature this. I, I love the fact that your head is actually over the... <laughs> Yeah, I've got, I can which, go above or which under. Which my head is not doing any of that. It can make for some bad hair days. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you right now, it's, uh, I think the temperature is actually 100 degrees outside. It's pretty toasty. So I'm curious as to the reaction people have when they see this car. I love the floating needle there. you turning that steering wheel. <laughs> There's no power steering on this thing, but we've got this nice big boat size steering wheel that makes it easy. Yeah. Ish. It feels comfy. It's a, it drives great. It really just floats down the road. You know, you shared something with me on the review video. What you, would you like about this car? When you're driving it right now with the top down, everything going by you, you're going at your own pace. You're not in a hurry to get anywhere. The world really gets to wait for you. Yeah, this is nice. It's a fun car to drive and it really, you don't need to go fast. And that's one of the beauties of this car. You could be going five, you could be going 50. And it's still just, just as thrilling. It's a wonderful cruiser. palm trees. It makes you feel like you're in a movie driving this car. A little bit. It almost takes you back to the, uh, the 1950s. Yeah. It's almost like you're in this car, but you're looking out the windshield to see the future. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what you get a little bit with some of the Gen H styling that they have in the car that you highlighted earlier. but in a car like this, uh, it just makes everything super smooth and quiet. Yeah, this is a parade car. You stick a couple of people on the back seat and just to show people out the back seat there. Beep the horn on this one. No. Oh. Okay, no horn on this no one. No horn on this one. <laughs> we tried. I saw the dual horn. I was, I was hoping we'd get that sound. That's gotta be a good sound. Dust all over it. Really? Even bits of hay. 
So this car <laughs> was a true barn true find. Barn find, yes. That is really cool. A wonderful sunny day in a ride here. Flathead Ford V8 convertible. It's got its perks, that's for sure. <laughs> that is awesome. All right, well, we're going to take this one back. I just want to thank you, Chris, for uh, being on my car story and taking a ride and uh, sharing with us what it feels like to go back to 1952. My pleasure. Thanks for having me.